Of course, you can try for any age, but just to be successful, you, you should stay in your generation and just go more than 20 year age difference. Okay, Ethan, I am 48 years young. Low, you're still young. Yeah, you what are. do you think my age range should be? I also have two school age children. So we all, always recommend not to go more than 20 year age uh, difference. So you're, uh, you will be perfect with uh, I say 30 20, and above. I say 30. eight and above. Yeah. Are you planning, if you're planning any more children, uh, so it should be uh, like um, uh, from 28 to 40, mm -hmm. like 28 to 38. And if you're not planning any more children from 28 to 45, are you planning it? To, you want any more children, Ethan, or is that it? Um, mm -hmm. More than likely, she might have kids unless you're looking for somebody who doesn't have kids yeah. and you want to have kids with her. Because if she doesn't have kids at that age, she's going to want them for sure. Yeah, but uh, just don't go over 20, year, uh, 20 years age difference so and you'll be perfectly fine. Mm -hmm. David, I'm 64 years old and wondering if I'm kidding myself. Are 37 to 55 year old women uh, not likely to be interested with our age difference? I think uh, 64, so you can go from uh, 44 and up. So, and I see that you uh, look at yeah, yeah, almost. Yeah, you should try. I think that will be okay. Yeah. I mean, don't. Guys, one thing, we say 20, okay? Um, because we feel you shouldn't go over that, that generation yeah. age gap. But if, if that's what you want, then go for it. You know what I mean? I mean, I'm, none of us here are going to, you know, chastise you or look down on you because you're going after someone who's 24 years younger. If that's what you really want and your heart desires it, then go for it. We'll still help you out. Okay, but we just found that that 20 years and younger gap is, uh, I guess, the safe zone. Mm -hmm. Yes, guys, and our we, we ba it's based on our experience of 25 years, you know, working with girls and guys. So, but of course, if you feel young enough, of course, you can try for any age. But you know, right. just to be successful, you should not go. You should stay in your generation and just go to no, not uh, you know more than 20 year age difference but you know mm -hmm. you feel we're not going to judge or anything we have successful couples who went uh, like more than 20 years difference but it's not a lot of them so and i think too i personally think you tell me if i'm wrong I think it, it depends on the ages. I'll give you an example. Let's say somebody is 45 years old, mm -hmm. okay? And he's gonna look at somebody who's 22 years old, okay? That's 23 year difference. Mm -hmm. Because of the, her age being so young, I think that's a big difference between a 65 year old and a 42 year old, I'm um, 43 year old. Yeah, that's that's correct. You know, and I mean, I even remember you had an interview with a girl, and she talked about that. Did she? That, okay, yes. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's right. Because yeah. if you go after that really young girl, and you know, it's more than twenty years, yeah, it's kind of you know difficult. Right. But if you are that like older, and the girl is older, so it's it's a different story. Right. But still, not to go like crazy like you are yes. 68 yes. and gold is 30 years old so I mean. you too can experience the romantic adventure of a lifetime join men from all over the world as they take a trip and find their future brides 
Interested? Learn more at russia-ladies.com. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. Then click on the notice bell to get notified every time we add something new.